So in this lesson, we're going to cover the login page. So we're logged into Kajabi under website design, under website pages, login. So let's click customize. So this is the page that your members are going to use to log in um, to their courses that they've paid for. And in mine, I've got my logo, I've got login, I've got email, password, remember me, login now and forgot password. So I'm going to show you how I set this up real quick. So we've got the header and footer that we've set up in previous lessons. And then we have this login button. So let's click on that. So the first thing you're going to see under login is that we have this show image. So if I were to uncheck that, that would remove it. In this case, I decided to put in my logo just to verify that they're on the right page, that this is Jordan outside. And then I'm not putting in an image width, but I did put in an alt attribute. So Jordan outside. And then we get into the section settings. So the first setting is your button. So let's click on this. You're going to see that it says login now. And I put the button background color as the red for my logo and then the button text color as white. And then the button width I've got is full. The button style is solid and the button size is medium. If you want to change the button style, you just click on it and it changes it, but I'm going to keep it at solid. Then the border radius I have at four. And that's it for the button settings in the background settings. Originally I uploaded an image. So I put the background media type to image. Um, if I didn't want that, I could just put none. Um, but I put image and then I uploaded this image. And when I previewed it, I didn't like the way that it looked. Um, so I added a background color over it. So let's say I went to background color and I went to transparent. Now you can see the image that's in the background. So the reason I didn't like it is that the email password, remember me, it kind of drowns out in this picture. Um, and so I decided against it. So in this case, what I want to do now is I want to put the background image to none. So then it's just a white background. And then I'm going to change the background color to this tan. So that way it kind of stands out a little bit more. Okay. And that's it for um, this section on the background. And then the last one is language and language is where you put in what you want them to see. So login text, I put login email text. I put email, so you see email right here, password text, password, remember me text, remember me, forgot password text, forgot password. So it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Um, you'd only change these if you had something, uh, within your branding that that you wanted it to match kind of your verbiage or how you talk about your brand uh, In this case, I left them as is and then always remember to click save to save all your settings And then if we go back go to sites click design And if you click on the login uh, tab here now you're gonna see a preview of what your members are gonna see when they go to log into their course that's it for this lesson. I'll see you in the next.